Ma, is this for me? Yeah, that's for you. Wow. Hmm. The smells make me water my mouth. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's go. Let's go for eating. Okay, listen to me. Jadi untuk idiom yang ini, the smell makes me water my mouth. Kita pakai idiom ini kapan? When we get condition, for example, I want you to imagine you are in the kitchen or you go to the kitchen. And in the kitchen, you find something and that meal is very delicious. Enggak tahu siapa yang buat, enggak tahu siapa yang beli, pokoknya ada di situ aja. Nah, kemudian kalau secara bahasa Indonesia kita akan bilang apa? Uh, yeah. Kayaknya enak nih. Hmm, baunya enak nih. Nah, ekspresi-ekspresi itu bisa kita ungkapkan dalam bahasa Inggris dengan kalimat Wow, the smell makes me water my mouth. Water my mouth. Mainnya kita ganti aja pakai ma. My mouth jadi my mouth. Ya, kita ulang yuk. One, two, three. The smell makes me water my mouth. The smell makes me water my mouth. Nah, maksudnya water di sini tuh bikin kita healer. Nah, when you get delicious food and you wanna eat that food, tapi belum dimakan, kita berekspresi dulu. Ini ekspresi yang kita pakai. The smells make me water my mouth.